Hi Capricorn, this is going to be your reading for February 2019. Check your moon, Venus and rising if the messages don't resonate or if you'd like more insights on your month. Also, giving away two decks this month, so leave a comment. You could either win the Romance Angels, Oracle Cards or the Psychic Tarot. Picking a male and female for Valentine's. Okay, so leave a comment if you'd like to be a part of the giveaway by commenting you've entered. What's going on with Capricorn? Memories of love. Just had this card for Sagittarius. Okay. Capricorn messages. Love messages for Capricorn. February 2019. Okay. The sun. Okay, let's see. Ooh, feelings. The empress. Someone you really attracted to. You got someone attractive in your life. The ace of wands. Some of you wanted a new start. Maybe wanting someone to forgive you. Or wanting to forgive someone and wanting them to come back. Feeling like it's not over though. Like, like the relationship still has potential. You still have feelings for them that are growing. The seven of wands. That's how you're seeing them. So they may be, they may have blocked you. Some of you may be blocked. Or some of you, this person is just being defensive. Or, you know, you may just feel like they may be defensive if you approach them. But they are missing you. Six of cups. They are missing you, they, that, that could be the memories of love, the Six of Cups, they're having memories of you. So this, for some of you, this could be someone way in the past. Like, like maybe that one person who you had a lot of feelings for, but had to let go. Like way, in, not way in the past, but by way in the past, I mean like last year, early last year. Um, or the person, or just the person before the, the one you're dealing with now. Okay, we have the Eight of Pentacles as how they feel. They could be wanting to work on the relationship with you. They could be wanting to, um, you know, maybe get themselves together so they can be with you or approach you. There's some work going on with them. Maybe they're too busy, but are thinking about you while while working. Let's see, the five of wands as how they're seeing you. So maybe you and them had a massive fight in the past, or you were just hard to deal with, or you lashed out on them. Something caused the breakup here. You know, this could be current, but I feel like a lot of you, it's um, like a while back. This person could be from a while back. Um, the King of Cups. So there could have been feelings between the both of you. It could be more spiritual. Like a spiritual connection that you guys still have. But don't really acknowledge. It's almost like the, the feelings are just... We're just thrown aside. But they're still alive. And so just a memory of this person may trigger the feelings. Um, not permanently, like just in the moment, like you'll feel for them in that moment when you remember them. Remember what you had. The world here as your outcome. Someone could be, it could be long distance. 
for some of you. Let's see, why is it Ace of Wands here? Something, you know, the relationship, it may have been unfair in the past, and maybe a misunderstanding. It could be why you want a new start with them. All right. The feelings could be burdening for you, and maybe they were really burdening when you guys just split. May have felt, um, may have felt like they drained you. Like, it, like the situation drained you in the past. So, let's see. Seven of Wands. There's seven of Wands here. Why did I do that? <laughs> I don't know why I went all the way up there. I'm still clarifying the Seven of Wands. That was weird. But I'm going to get to that. Yeah, blocked you. This is someone who may have blocked you in the past. May have chose someone else over you. Or you chose someone else over them and they blocked you. Some of you, it could be different scenarios, but there is being blocked here for some of you. Here we have the Queen of, of Pentacles. And, you know, so they may have feelings, um, maybe remembering feelings that they had for you, these nurturing feelings. Some of you, they probably want you to be their baby mom <laughs> or, or their baby dad because we have a parent here with the kids. But like, let me see. The Six of Cups. Yeah, they don't want to be single anymore. They may have spent a long period of time being single. Now they want companionship. And I remember it like it could be that they're just remembering what they had with you and thinking of the possibilities of it working. So for some of you, this could be someone way in the past. Some of you it could be someone current. OK, I just get this long time feeling. Eight of Wands, they may want to reach out to you. They may even be traveling. As I said, some of you could be long distance from this person. They could be traveling towards you or just reaching out via social media um, based on maybe what they see. Maybe they see pictures of you and they, um, the judgment of you changes where they want to reach out or they see you um, that you've changed or made some changes in your life. Why is the five of wands here? Five of wands. Let's see. You may have been hard to please, yet... Um, something they've always wished for, maybe looks-wise, maybe you're really attractive to them. I found you really attractive, but then you're kind of hard to please, causing fights that could have caused fights that you were hard to please, or maybe they were hard to please. Um, someone could have been stubborn, which caused the fights. They could have had fun times. So they're remembering the good times and the bad times here. Yeah. King of Cups. Why is the King of Cups here? So it could be it may not have been the right time for some of you in the past that time well maybe it was bad timing where the universe just cut it off kind of in a way it just wasn't the right time for you you had some lessons to learn it may be now you guys may come out of the cold with each other or maybe revisit the feelings or just kind of talk but at that time it just wasn't the right time 
or if you're separated now from this person, maybe it's not the right time now. And that's why you're separated. Where's the world here? There may still be little fights here and there. If you do speak to this person again, maybe your feelings are not, uh, maybe you didn't get closure and you may lash out on them again. Um, or you may tell them to go away. Maybe they hurt you that bad. Um, you may, you, this may be for closure. Like some of you, if this person's from way in the past, this could be a revisit for you to get closure and an explanation. And some of you, if this is a current situation, you're currently blocked, you know, things are not, um, not really improving this month with this person. The feelings are still there between the both of you though, but something happened where there was conflict and someone's blocked here. You're wanting to get rid of these burdening feelings, especially if it's a current situation. You may currently be burdened by these feelings, feeling drained, feeling like your emotion, your feelings for them are not dying, um, and you didn't get what you want. This may continue from for February, um, but it may come to it. It may. Let me see. I just don't want to deliver bad news. Like it may not be resolved this month. If it's current. Alright. Capricorn. Reconciliation. Someone from your past is returning. I told you. <laughs> Someone. Some of you this person is from way in the past. And they're thinking about you. Let's see. Keep an open mind. Your soulmate may differ from your usual type and expectations. Express your love. Go ahead and make the romantic gesture. And stay optimistic about your love life. Positive thinking will bring you romance. for Capricorn there is no need to hurry or force things to happen everything is occurring in perfect timing so yeah if, if it doesn't work out this month don't worry or force it it's things are gonna work out soon for you household situation is improving either through a move or a healthy change in the occupants it could improve by the end of the month Endings and beginnings, the old must be released so that the new can enter. Get enclosure from someone from the past. Or the person from the past could be the one. It depends on your situation. True love, the romantic stirrings in your heart have propelled the universe to deliver great love to you. All right. Messages for Capricorn. Intuition. Suffering in silence. Triumph, deception, and envy. This 
person from the past could have been the jealous type. Maybe they see you um, on social media with someone new or being people hitting on you, you know, triggers them to want to say something. Suffering in silence though, so you may, you may have carried a lot of pain from this past relationship and haven't, and like they have no idea that they hurt you. Well, they probably know they hurt you, but not, don't know how much they hurt you. Okay, but here you have intuition. So you're reconciling with someone for what reason or for where where it goes depends on you like if it's just closure or if you end up together here you have intuition so it basically depends on you and what you or your intuition is telling you about your personal situation when it happens okay but here we have triumph so you will come out on top you know you may get closure or you may have the upper hand if there was a third party in the past you may be the one who this person chooses to be with you know they may have gotten rid of the third party ages ago and you didn't know you know you may start brand new or you may just get closure from someone okay but yeah that's the main thing here someone from the past these past memories of love are coming back to haunt you for sure this month february so just be prepared for that for the past to come back okay it may be something that you need on your journey especially if you want to move forward you may need to just get that closure and move on or this person could be the one for you who knows so capricorn this was your reading for February 2019, check your moon, Venus and rising if the messages don't resonate or if you'd like more insight. Also, leave a comment if you'd like to be one of two winners for the giveaway, the February giveaway for the Romance Angels Oracle cards or the Psychic Tarot. Let me know which one you'd like to win. By doing so, you've entered the competition. So like this video if you enjoyed, subscribe if you haven't already and thanks for watching.